National Eyewear Day. Mm. Did you also know glasses have been around for 700 years? Really? Who knew? It's a long time. It is. And there's actually a family business here in St. Louis that hasn't been around for quite that long, but they still have quite a bit of history. Here's Andy Larico with how they make the spectacular spectacles right on the Del Mar Loop. So if eyes are the window to the soul, then a good pair of glasses are like the eyes windows to the rest of the world. So making them requires quite a bit of focus. There's not many industries out there that you have to marry fashion and a medical device all in one. The guys at the Copper Hinge have it down to a science in a pretty small space. The typical factory might have I don't know, 70 to 80 different machines just to make one pair of glasses, but we were able to condense ours to about 19 machines, really. It starts with long sheets of plastic, cured in ovens for six days. It's taking the moisture out, almost like a beef jerky process. Laying out the canvas. You can start cutting away different parts that we want. For the frames. Then adding more on. This crystal will become these nose pads, and it'll fuse it together like it'll be one piece. It takes a multi-step process just to make that little curve between the lenses. Just to be able to give it more comfort. Not seeing glasses yet? After I have all that loaded and retooled, which is the, the hard part, we press go. You will soon. It's cutting the outside shape now, which would really be like, oh, wow, this is awesome. This is my next pair of glasses. But at this point still, there's so much more that has to be done to be able to make the pair of glasses saleable, and you're not going to wear something that's real rough and hard around the edges. So to smooth things over, they go for a tumble. Copper Hinge this, uses barrels of wood chips. See that, that sheen that's coming off, it's really pretty. Um, these have been in for you know just a couple hours this morning, but these will be going for about seven to 12 more hours. Finally, the hinges, temple. Yeah, so it just presses it in like a hot needle and it goes in super fast. And the prescription lenses before they're ready to see and be seen. You have to be different, you have to be something that's special with a story behind you and why you are special. But you could argue they already are pretty special as part of one of the oldest eyeglass manufacturing families in the world, the fifth generation, all the while based right here in St. Louis. For Five on Your Side, I'm Abby Larico. Hmm, I love that they're local. Okay, so here's some fun factoids from Abby. You know the wood chips that she was showing yeah. us? They actually come from next door, Salt and Smoke, the restaurant Salt and Smoke, from You're the kidding. wood barrels, and they use the wood chips to smooth the glasses. That Isn't is that so cool. I wonder if they smell really yummy when they <laughs> you come out. You want to eat them? Yeah, and, and <laughs> another fun fact from Abby, they're actually Urker's eyewear, and then Copper Copper Hinge is just the company they launched within the past two years of uh -huh. a brand specifically. So Urker's, you said that yes. you've, you've you're I've, familiar with them. Yes, I am. They're well known here in St. Louis. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty cool. It's great. Yeah. All right. It's